right here. Kill him. Green Sally up, a green Sally down. Last gun start, got a tail to crown. Green Sally up, a green Sally down. Last gun start, got a tail to crown. Green Sally up, a green Sally down. Last gun start, got a tail to crown. Good morning, everybody. This is vlog number two. We have a bunch of birds moving in. We had a cold front come through just this week. Uh, my buddy Noah is coming to pick me up right now and we're headed to Goddard, Kansas to hunt with my buddy Ross Wheeler and his dad and one of my good friend's dads, John Fanning. I got Noah with me today. He's driving since my truck's in the shop. But like I said, we're headed to Goddard and we're going to kill some ducks. Got anything to add? Well, hopefully make a pile of day and stay in school and bless your duck hunt. That's the only way to do it right there. This is a nice surprise, Bobby. I didn't know he was coming with us this morning. Didn't even know my beautiful face was gonna be. Here. No, I didn't. Have I no did. idea. I just, I just slide in unexpected. Hopefully, we get some birds this morning. Oh, we, well, we got a whole crew of people here this morning. I didn't realize Bobby and his buddy Wade were gonna be here. We got Ross and his dad, and then John Fanning and Noah and I. So it's gonna be a good hunt, right, Ross? Call it. Order. Hey, someone gonna call it? Why did no one call it? You guys see that? Are you gonna call it? Look what's in front of you. Take them. Oh, we got two down. That was long shooting, boys. Woo! Single right there. Oh, that boy did. Pretty one there. That's a fucking old Drake. Look at that. This is a uh, spoiled rotten city here. I feel all kind of spoiled. We're a little late. No way. We're a little late on that caller. <laughs> God dang, your lens is soaked, boy. Is the front of it soaked? Yeah. Nice. Kill him. Kill him. You got anything to say in there? All I gotta say is, uh, look at this. 
First one, first time I've ever held one of these funky looking chickens. <laughs> Chicken. They all wanted me to move in because my white face out there was too pretty. I it was scaring the ducks off. We got six, six people deep in here now. Right now, the ducks aren't wanting to finish over these goose decoys. I'm trying to open up a bigger hole for them. Look at the pelicans. Holy cow. Well, at least something likes our decoy spread. Oh, there's geese low, but ducks high. Kill him! Woo! Yeah! There we go! Hey, they're coming back, man. Come on back! Oh, load up, load up! They're coming back! Includes this hunt. We're gonna start picking up the decoys. We ended up with five, five geese, and I don't know how many ducks. I'll get a count here in a second, but there's a few there. And uh, we're gonna pack our shit up and head to Leon tonight. Uh, do a roost shoot out there. There's a bunch of birds flying around, a bunch of geese out there. So we'll see how that goes. Three geese, a couple greenheads, two canvas back, three canvas back, a widgeon. We're gonna pack our shit up and head to Leon for an evening hunt. We are headed east now to Leon. I got some buddies coming in. Uh, they're from Texas. They leased some land up here and he messaged me on Instagram. And we're gonna meet up with him and see what we can do this evening. Uh, it's really cloudy out. I don't know how that's going to affect the birds on how late they come in for the roost, but it could be interesting. Hopefully they come before shooting light with how dark it is, or with how dark it's going to get. But we're going to set up some full body geese, full body ducks, floaters, the whole shebang, see how that goes. Birds all over the water. You can't really see it very well, but because there's a hill in front of us. But we're gonna find a spot to set up, and we'll check back then. All right, good. Uh, we're gonna drive around and meet these guys at the other gate, and then uh, get our decoy set up. Damn, a bunch just came in. You want to see that? Or about 30 or 40. Uh, I bet all the greenheads. Like, there's a lot of divers out there. I bet all the mallards are feeding right now. Or out on the, the feeder ponds. Eating somewhere. This pond we're hunting is kind of a, there's not a whole lot of fields out in this area. Uh, it's about a 40 acre watershed and it's got everything for them. Food, they loaf there, and they roost there. So it's not, normally when we hunt it, it's not just right at the last 30 minutes of shooting light. They come piling in there. It's for, oh my God, that bridge is closed. Look at all those green heads. Holy shit. Alright, so we got the all the decoys set up right now. Got a a little pot of goose floaters and a little hole, probably four or five dozen mallards out and a dozen full bodies. We got six layout blinds. 
all lined up here. Mallards have been dumping in on us while we're setting up. I bet there's every bit of five, six hundred mallards on here when we got here. So it should get good. Set our spread and realized we set the horseshoe backwards. I have no idea how that happened. So we're out here rotating this around. We ended up with like six ducks. Jumped 500 off when we got here and they never came back. We got a cold front moving in tomorrow and could have pushed them down south, but I don't know. We're gonna pick up the decoys and try and hunt again in the morning. Yeah.